guys welcome to my channel in today's video I'll be sharing my pumping routine with you guys so if this is something that you're interested in then just keep on watching all right so my son he will be six months on the ninth and I'm currently pumping six times a day I get about 50 ounces or more each day I made this pumping schedule based off of what works for both me and my son so you can tailor your pumping schedule to whatever you need so the way that um, I schedule our day is I have workouts Monday through Friday at 6 a.m. So the very first pumping session that I'll do is at 4, between 4.45 a.m. and 4.50ish in the morning. And I'll pump for about 40 minutes. because I go between seven and eight hours at night and so my boobs are pretty full after that long night of rest for the rest of the day I pump after I feed my son so um, I he wakes up between 7 30 and 8 15 closer to the 8 15 okay. side but at 8 15 that's him he woke up early from his nap today so if you hear him he's over there chewing on his teething ring right now but anyways so if he wakes up at 8.15 and then I'll pump around 8.50 or 8.45 depending on what time I finish up with him. And I'll kind of show you different clips. I'll insert a man of me pumping throughout the day and kind of how much I'm pumping. gets in the way sometimes and so I don't stick to this schedule like <laughs> sometimes I get off it just happens in the beginning when I was pumping I was struggling y'all because 
I had so many bottles. I would pump and then I would put that milk in a bottle and every time I would pump, I would put it in a new bottle. So by the end of the day, I would have 50 million bottles in my fridge. Oh my gosh. It was too many because at the, when I was uh, sterilizing and washing them, it was just overwhelming. So I was looking at Pinterest, looking at YouTube try, to try to figure out what I can do differently and I found the pitcher method. Best thing since sliced bread. So, with the pitcher method, I have two pitchers. I have one 50 ounce pitcher and then I'll have like a smaller um, hospital cup. So they have to have lids just you don't want to have any spills and then you lose all your milk for the day. So basically when I pump fresh milk in the morning, that four, let's say that it's that 4.50 a.m. Um, session. When I pump that milk, I'll put that in a glass pitcher. The next time I pump around 8.50, I'll have to put that fresh milk into my um, hospital cup. So now I have my 4.30 a.m. in my pitcher and then I'll have my 8.30 a.m. milk in the hospital cup. So when I pump that third time, I'm going to transfer the milk in the hospital cup over to that 50 ounce glass pitcher. I rinse out my hospital cup and then I'll put that fresh milk from the third pump into the hospital cup. And then I'll put both of those back in the fridge. I rinse out my pumping stuff, um, my pumping bottles and uh, my flanges and I put those in Ziploc bags. When you put those in Ziploc bags, I usually, I'll, because I, I'm keeping it in the fridge, I'm keeping it fresh, I don't wash those or sterilize those until the end of the night after my last pump. And then of course I'll use a new set um, the next day and then I'll just rotate them out. So I'm using two different pitchers because um, it's not good to mix the chilled milk with the fresh warm milk. When you do that, it makes it susceptible for bacteria. So, Pinterest, you go. That's where I got all this information from. I'll um, try to see if I can find it and I'll link it below. Towards the end of the night, once I've pumped all of my sessions, then I'll make go ahead and make uh, my son's bottles for the next day. leftover milk that I'll have I'll put that in baggies and put it in the freezer and then that's how I'm um I have uh, so much milk y'all like our freezer is full of breast milk nothing else just breast milk I wanted to mention one more thing so my brain y'all is is out of whack since I've had a baby so I use this app to help me remember when to feed yet, how many times I'm changing it. The app is called Baby Tracker. So I'll actually insert um, this into the video as well to show you how I'm keeping track of how many ounces I'm pumping, how many bottles, how much, and like this as well. That is everything that I wanted to include in this video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Make sure you like and subscribe.